Hey guys, welcome to our channel. So, I was going to do this video last night, but some of you know I've got a kind of a hurt hand and I didn't feel like it. I just didn't feel like it and I should have. And tonight I'm doing it anyway because this is some BS right here. And I, I know that we've been, we haven't gone to Walmart since the job scam, since they had these, since they were doing this fake phony baloney crap and trying to have people do their background checks through their spam folders, which was weird. But this trumps it. This, this is, uh, you guys, I don't know how many of you have seen this. I'm going to link this dude's video and he suggested telling five people. Well, I told a few people and nobody seemed to care. Hell, that's got me gonna this weekend gonna do some research and show everybody why they should care. Now that what they've gone ahead and done, and I'm gonna provide a link to the Washington Post, and I'm gonna provide a link to this guy's video. What they've done, and that uh, is they've emptied out these WalMarts, put up cages, and they've been storing children, immigrant children in these cages in Walmarts that they empty out and apparently all Walmarts are made to they can within eight hours they can have these detention camps up now years ago I watched this guy do a video when I was still in Salina Kansas and he was at a Walmart in Texas probably this very Walmart by the way I mean I'm guessing I don't know but he was at a Walmart in Texas that they were clearing out and when he got close enough that he got surrounded by cops and escorted off, I wonder why they didn't want anybody to know what was going on. So here's what they got. They can clear out a Walmart in eight hours and put up cages. And I guess you call them FEMA camps or concentration camps, perhaps. Walmart. Great people. At Walmart going on there and I ain't shopping there she ain't shop we ain't shopping there anymore nobody should be shopping there absolutely nobody should be shopping at Walmart at all spend an extra buck <laughs> and kill them just knock them off I mean that's the only way I mean you got to stop shopping there everybody has to I know I can't make everybody stop shopping there <sighs> So they know one is, oh, it probably won't happen. And they'll probably keep putting people in these things. But And, and oh, yeah, it's immigrant kids, but just wait. I'm going to do some research this weekend on a video I saw where they were running these drills in Florida where the Army swept in in the middle of the night and was hauling people in armored vehicles at gunpoint. But it was supposed to be a drill, right? Fake. I bet. Why in the world would they have to drill for swooping in in the middle of the night and taking people at gunpoint away to an undisclosed location? Why? Why would they have to drill for that? Unless they were planning on doing it. And if that's the case, we should be dem demo in all Walmarts, right? We should like line up with demolition equipment. It, wrecking balls and jackhammers and get it all cleared out and just tear them down right is that where they're going to put everybody who are they going to put there well maybe it is maybe it does have to do with the mandela effect maybe they're keeping tabs maybe they're going to put all of us that see what's really going on maybe they're going to come try to sweep us away in the middle of the night how about that that's all right it's okay they can shoot me, but they can't take me to Walmart and put me in a cage. So, all right, this one bugs me a little bit. They're literally putting people, kids, though. I mean, it's kids. They, they These are kids. As, uh, supposedly, these are just kids, like immigrants. They deport the parents and put the kids in cages. Four years, some of these kids have been in cages. And what's the end game? I mean, you've deported the parents. And what are you going to do? When are you going to release these angry kids? Or are you brainwashing them? What's going on? I mean, what's the end game? Are you just going to pay to house them in Walmart forever? <laughs> Four years, that's long enough, right? And the kids didn't commit a crime for 
<sighs> anyway, it's whatever. But I'm putting it out there. He said to tell five people, maybe I'll hit 20. And maybe five of you won't have heard of it. And maybe some of you will look it up if you haven't. And maybe, just maybe, some of you won't shop at Walmart anymore. Those crooked mother. Hmm. Anyway, I'm going to let that video go at that. Uh, I'm going to put the Washington Post thing down and I'm going to put the, this dude's video and I'm going to leave it at that. I got some other things I'm trying to look up. Now I want to look up these drills because they seem like pretty important stuff going on and I can't really find much on them, but I will. I'll dig. I'm finding other stuff. It, it's all kind of screwy Louie if you ask me. So I'm going to let this video go at that, guys. This really isn't a thumbs up, thumb down video, but go ahead. Thumb it up if, if you think this is a bunch of shit. Yeah, I said it. Disclaimer now, I ain't redoing the video. Oops, I didn't mean to, but it, it's, it, it is. It's a bunch of BS, guys. We shouldn't even be standing for that. This That's more like Nazi Germany stuff. You, know, you just need to add some, what, gas chambers, right? And is that the end game? Because there's only so many Walmarts. How many people are you going to stuff in Walmarts and for how many years? Before you're going to have to do something, you're going to have to let them go? And again, when it doesn't make any sense, it's stupid. I hardly ever use that word, but it's stupid. It's dumb. It doesn't make any sense. <sighs> Wait till they turn 18 and turn them loose on the streets. Deport them. What? Do they have a plan? I can't find out what their plan is if they do. But anyway, guys, I'm going to let this go at that. I should have done this last night. And I feel I'm, tonight I just wasn't going to put it off at all. So um, thanks, guys. Uh, thanks for all your thumbs up, thumbs down, comments, subscriptions. And uh, right now, and don't shop at Walmart. Even if you shop at the other scam places, don't shop there. <sighs> Make them go out of business. Do something. Yeah. Anyway, have a good rest of your night, guys.